Yeah. He's going to teach us how to make a living on YouTube or die trying. Please welcome Dave Jones. Thank you very much. two years my full-time job has been making a living on YouTube a job category that didn't exist five years ago yes I'm one of those weirdos I can't see the audience it's crazy let me throw some stats at you there's one trillion views last year on YouTube that's 140 views for every person on the planet it's insane and there's over a million people like me making money from their YouTube videos. <laughs> Unfortunately, most of them don't make enough money to buy food for their stupid cat that they're hoping will do something stupid and go viral. Hands up if you hate cat videos. Come on! Yes! So where do I stand against the real YouTube celebrities? You know, the ones with actual talent, good looks, <laughs> sense of humour. Uh, you know, video production skills. Well, I rank somewhere below that fat kid with a lightsaber. <laughs> You've seen the video. <laughs> I've got a lousy 11 million views and over 500 videos and 50,000 subscribers. And I am ranked, wait for it folks, number 6,153 in the world! Yes, thank you! Here's a photo of me at my old job designing some widget that just got shit canned six months later anyway. <laughs> now I produce videos daily for people who actually appreciate it. Huge difference. Let me tell you. How do I do it? These bloody annoying ads. You've seen them, right? There are pop-up overlay ads, pre-roll ads, sidebar ads, selection ads, campaign ads, and the most annoying of all, the ones that pop up right in the middle of the bloody video. <sighs> Some ads I get paid per view, others I get paid per click. All I know is that each month the Google Ferry drives by in one of these Google Street View vans and tosses a load of cash onto my front lawn. It's brilliant. But I'm not allowed to encourage you to click on my ads because if I do, they'll shut me down. My wife will be pissed. My little boy here will starve. And worst of all, I'll have to go back and get a real day job. No thanks. Google make $50 billion a year. Of that, $17 billion is AdSense advertising income, and of that, $12 billion goes into the pockets of people like me. That's a lot of pie, folks. <laughs> Unfortunately, if I tried to make a living out of just the money from the YouTube videos, I'd be sharing an apartment with a fat geek like this, or half a dozen of them, and they probably have Cats. I do not like it. I don't want to go there. Even with 25,000 views every single day, it's still not enough for me to make a living from it. I have to uh, sell merchandise like this shirt. I have to um, accept donations. I have to have direct advertising. It takes about 100,000 views a day to make a living from this full time. Some of the advantages. You get to be your own boss. Really, you can work any 12 hours a day you want, folks. <laughs> Trust me. But I've got a little two-year-old boy, and I've been with him every day since he was born, and that's awesome lifestyle, let me tell you. Here he is. We, isn't he cute? We entered him in the Bonds Baby Contest, <laughs> along with 50,000 others. The winner was decided by internet vote. You guessed it. We won! Yes! But we didn't cheat. We didn't cheat. No, he's just got 50,000 more fans than your average baby. <laughs> When you become a successful video blogger, um, it can lead to media opportunities, TV, sponsorship, travel, all sorts of stuff. But thankfully, you won't see my head on TV any time soon because I've got a head for radio and a voice for cartoons. Some of the downsides. I worked my ass off for two years making hundreds of videos in my two metre by two metre garage in 40 degree heat on the weekends. And if you stop making the videos, they stop watching just like your favourite TV show at the end of the season. The YouTube comments! Oh, there is no more wretched horror of scum and villainy. I have to put up with daily abuse and death threats from 40 year olds in their mum's basement. Like, other, um, like all the other uh, YouTube success stories, I didn't plan any of this, just uploaded some videos for, for some fun. Thought it would be great. And it just snowballed in terms of views, number of subscribers, and now I make a full time living from it. The last two years. 
but two years ago, my company gave me the ass, packed up, moved to China. So I went, bugger this, I'm doing this full time. And here's a photo of me at my trade uh, show stand next to my former $100 million company. And yes, my stand is bigger. Yes. Sucked in. So if you've got something you want to share with the world, folks, just do it. You never know where it's going to lead. You might even find yourself with a new career like I did. Just be enthusiastic. That's all it takes. Content is king, folks. Thank you very much.